Hi, my name is Bess Adler. I'm a documentary photographer and photojournalist, and I'm a Fuji film creator. I'm passionate about visual storytelling and working on long-term projects in photography. I'm excited to share five tips on creating meaningful photo stories. Tip number one, have an idea and do the research. When you decide on a story that you want to pursue, doing research on the community is really important. Uh, whether that means making phone calls, conducting interviews, reading books and articles, doing this research shows that you have respect for the community that you're photographing. Doing the research will also help you create an honest portrayal of that community. The story might turn into something completely different than you thought it would, but it's really important to be open to that and also stay well informed. Tip number two, trust and collaboration are key. Whether you're photographing a person or an entire community, you have to look at it as a collaboration. The, the people that you're photographing are right there alongside you. Once you recognize that it's a collaboration, it's really important to establish trust. This might mean not even picking up your camera for a few days while you spend time with the people that you're planning on photographing. Once there's trust, you could really photograph honest and vulnerable stories. Tip number three, make beautiful work. While the entire series should be a beautiful visual narrative, each photo should adhere to an aesthetic standard. Always pay attention to composition and lighting. If you feel like you need practice with this, just go take a walk on the street with your camera. Once you become comfortable with this practice, you can apply the skills you learn to your photo essay. Tip number four, document intimate moments. Intimate moments in your photographs help evoke emotion and allow people to connect to the story. They don't always have to show physical closeness, but they need to show emotional closeness and vulnerability. The people that you're photographing are completely absorbed in their own moment and let the world around them fade away. The more you get to know the people you're photographing, the more you'll understand when these moments might happen and why they're meaningful. Tip number five, edit well. Editing your photo essay is one of the most important parts of building your visual narrative. The photo story should have a beginning, a middle, and an end, and the photos should be sequenced in a way that flow well together. You might have an amazing single image that just doesn't fit in and it might just have to go. Make sure that you have some detail photos, you have a sense of place, and the viewer should really understand what the main focus of the story is, whether that's an issue or a person. I hope these tips helped. I'm really excited to see the stories you create. You can find me on my Instagram at Bess Adler or my website at www.bessadler.com. Thank you.